Hello everyone, this is Evie the Sponge Reviewer here with my review on the Spongebob movie Sponge Out of Water, released on February 6, 2015 in theaters. So the synopsis of this movie is that um, a pirate by the name of Burger Beard stumbles upon this magic book, which anything that he writes comes true. So he uses this book to steal the Cry Party Secret formula, and it is up to Spongebob, Plankton, and the rest of the Bikini Bottom gang to travel outside of Bikini Bottom into the real world to retrieve back the secret formula. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and move on with the criticism of this movie, and that is the CGI moments. Now, um, the, the reason why I put this as a criticism is that um, the, the movie was advertising a lot of those CGI moments, thinking that this entire movie was going to be taking place outside of Bikini Bottom, and that really isn't the case, is because that majority of the first and second act of this film is 2D animated. So the fact that majority of the CGI was being advertised in the, in the commercials for this movie, it was thinking that this whole movie was going to be taking place outside of Bikini Bottom, but that really wasn't the case. So that gets points deducted, but that doesn't mean that this movie was bad, in my opinion. Uh, speaking about those CGI moments, uh, I really do love the live action scenes. They were really entertaining. Uh, the characters jump from 2D to 3D was was absolutely phenomenal. The character designs were really good. The textures were, were nice. And yeah, the animation was really good as well. Uh, the live action scenes outside of Bikini Bottom were filmed in Tybee Island in Savannah, Georgia, which is actually a really cool fun fact because that I am a Georgia resident. Um, I've never been to Tybee Island, but I am familiar with that beach down in Savannah. All right, so now moving on to some of my favorite highlight moments of the movie. Uh, some of that will will be uh, SpongeBob and Plankton uh, going to the Chum Bucket, trying to retrieve a key that Patrick stole in to take it away from him while they are trying to avoid getting caught by... Um, the Bikini Bottom news is because that ever since Mr. Krabs heard the news about Spongebob and Plankton are teaming up, they decide to track him down. So that was some of the moments in the movie, some of my favorite moments. Uh, another really funny moment that I really enjoyed was um, the opening scene of Burger Beard trying to steal the book um, from Bikini Atolls. He's like um, basically going through these booby traps. He fights off a skeleton. That was a really funny moment. Uh, the, there were these seagull characters in the movie, which I found okay, I guess. They weren't really all that great, but it was nice to see um, this live-action pirate interacting with these seagull characters. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and squeeze in one more highlight in the movie that I really enjoyed, and that is the character's superpowers. Yes, um, the characters in the movie become superheroes. SpongeBob is the Invincible Bubble. Patrick is Mr. Super Awesomeness. Squidward is Sour Note. Mr. Krabs is Sir Penchalot. Plankton is Plankton. And Sandy is the Rodent. So I really do love all the characters becoming superheroes to stop Plank... Oh, I'm sorry. To stop Burger Beard from stealing the Krabby Patty Secret Formula, in which they do. All right, so that's my review on Sponge Out of Water. It wasn't all that much because I wasn't going... I wasn't going to go way into depth in it. So this is a pretty solid movie. It was a pretty good movie. I really enjoyed it. And I'll probably give this movie a, a 7 or an 8 out of 10. Pretty good movie. And yeah, it was actually better than the first Spongebob movie, in my opinion. Alright, so that was my really quick review on the Spongebob movie, Sponge Out of Water. Um, I know this movie is pretty old, but I wanted to review it anyways. just because that I needed something to review for this channel now that I'm done with season 12. And yeah, those are pretty much all the Spongebob reviews I'm going to do for this channel until season 13 comes along. Yes, you guys, I'm not going to review... Any older episodes, I'm not doing that. I'm only going to focus on the newer stuff. So until season 13 comes along, which I have no idea when, this channel will currently be dead at the moment. Well, not completely. It's because that I'm going to be doing live streams on this channel really soon. So be on the lookout for that, which I'll drop the channel update for that video in the description if you guys want to check that out. And yeah, so that's my review on Sponge Out of Water. What are your thoughts on the movie if you've seen it? Well, I know, I think, I, I'm pretty am sure a majority of you guys have already seen the movie, but I still want to hear you guys' opinions on it, but whatever. All right, so that's it. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time with more content.